IFC Women's U.S. Middleweight Championship. The ladies can throw down, fellas. I'm looking forward to this fight. Janelle Marquez against Amanda Bugner. And speaking of the ladies, I'll tell you what, this young lady can put it together. She's joining our broadcast team. Undefeated Jim, tell me a little bit about this young lady sitting next to us here. Uh, this is legitimately one of my favorite fighters. I've been a fan of hers for about two years. Uh, Jennifer Howe, number one, 125 pound woman, and probably looked at by most a pound for pound the number one women's fighter in the world today. She is unreal, and she's actually been in the ring against one of these girls fighting tonight, so it's a pleasure to have her. Jennifer, welcome. On Good board to have you. In this fight. You gotta tuck up now. We, we, we're gonna have to turn on. She's got that fourth headset, so we'll have to turn that on. We'll get it hooked up here. And you look at Janelle Marquez. Let's see what she can do tonight in the women's fight. Ladies and gentlemen, our next match of the evening is the IFC Women's United States Middleweight Championship fight. It will be five three minute rounds. Introducing into the IFC cage on my left, a specialist in submission wrestling. She's a member of the prestigious Victory Athletics fight team. Five feet two inches tall, a ready to go, 135 pounds. She comes to us from Olympia, Washington. Please welcome Janelle. More check, check, check. Good look at Janelle and Jennifer. First off, we want to welcome you to the broadcast booth. We figure, you know, the fellas, we can only talk so much about it. We need somebody that, that's fun as a lady that knows exactly what you go through. Jennifer, good to have you aboard. Thanks for having me. Jennifer, this lady walking to the ring, you know very well. I tell you what, Amanda Buckner, let me just say this. MMAweekly.com's Ken Kishner said this was the fight of the, of the year as far as he's concerned between you and Amanda. Tell us a little bit about Amanda Buckner since you fought against her. Amanda is really aggressive. She throws a lot of punches, a lot of straight punches, good right hands. She doesn't back down, and it takes a lot to make her quit. No doubt about it, and you were fortunate to do it. We'll talk about that in one second. Let's go to a ring announcer, Mr. Jeff Weller. And introducing her opponent on my right. She is a specialist in jujitsu, a member of the Mixed Martial Arts Academy. Five feet four inches tall, a well conditioned one. 133 pounds. She's fighting locally out of Denver, Colorado. Please welcome to the IFC cage, Amanda Buckner. Good look there to Amanda Buckner. Now, Jennifer, uh, it says jujitsu. We didn't see much jujitsu with that matchup, did we, against uh, you and you and Amanda? No, it was three minutes of just throwing punches. So well, I'll tell, I tell you what, I was able to talk to uh, I was able to talk to Amanda yesterday, and she said she, uh, because she's so young in this sport, she unfortunately falls into her opponent's best part. Well, let's see what happens. Janelle and Amanda getting ready to get after it, and right away Janelle wants to show some head bang, movement. Bang, bang, bang! Look at this. Oh, oh good beautiful good right shot by, by Janelle. Janelle. How about Janelle landing a nice right hand? Nice elbow. Good beautiful takedown. takedown. Good takedown by Amanda Buckner. And I tell you what, looking at this early moments, Jennifer, both ladies landed some shots and goes right to the ground now. I think the biggest thing is, is you know, Janelle powering Amanda with that headlock right there, you know? Yeah. And, yeah. It's one of those things she's gonna go for the match. She's definitely got some strength and she's knowing how to use it. I mean, we've seen her, she was cutting a lot of weight yeah. to get in this fight. You she know, had to and cut her hair off to make weight. <laughs> cut the hair off. Cut you know? six inches of hair. What's that all about? Yeah, we wouldn't know. Yeah. We wouldn't know, but I tell no you what, idea. ladies right now are working very hard. Look at this. In the opening she's moments. working a good head and arm right now, and she, you know, she's trying to put the pressure on her. She needs to start striking at some point. You this know, keeping her base and start scoring those points. Amanda's going to keep trying to come around behind her. Now, Jennifer, oh, actually, Look I was going to say, what are you going to do if you're Amanda? But she did what she wants to do best. She got right out. Up. I don't think Janelle can hit her because she can get out of there real quick. There's a kick by Amanda. Now, the thing, when you fought with Amanda, it, oh, it, it's the power kick. 
Is the power there, Jennifer, when you see Amanda? Because she's really trying to throw technique-wise, but is the power behind it? Amanda's got a lot of power. Both ladies get after it right now. And Amanda I've actually, wants to take down. I've never had my bell ring before until Amanda cracked me with a right. That's the first time. Good Whoa. start. You know, and wow. Janelle throwing the kick. She's, you like that? Oh, like that. You, know, you like that? I'm, she threw two. She hit so with the Amanda one. So Amanda comes with a running <laughs> knee. How's about you have a fly in one of these? And now we got the guillotine. Nice. Oh, 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 look at the power have of Amanda mercy. Bushman. Hoisted her up, cross body into a big slam. Amanda is actually a power lifter. You can really? see that. Show it right. right there, I'll tell you. No yeah. doubt about it. You know, fellas, uh, uh, Jennifer is uh, absolutely correct. Before, a year and a half ago, when she first started fighting, she knew nothing of the game. She didn't even know what a takedown was. She didn't even know what the guard was. She didn't even know how to stand when she threw punches. All she did was play basketball and lift weights, and look at her now. Good stuff. I tell you what, both ladies making a very good account of themselves. Good left hand yeah, by Amanda. Hand. Once again, just we see a lot of quickness with Amanda. Janelle showing some good power, some good kicks early. You know, Jennifer, the, the women's game just continues to evolve, doesn't it? Amanda has improved her game a lot since last time we fought the... Oh, look at this! Yes. Going for, for a heel! Man. Going for a heel! Janelle needs to... Oh, that's it's it! It's over! That's it, she tapped out! She tapped out! Beautiful. Great technique. Beautiful. Great technique by Amanda Butler. She was the favorite going today. Janelle made a great account of herself. Beautiful. Great kick. She looked very good in the fight. Give both ladies a lot of yes, credit in this fight. absolutely. Ladies and gentlemen, your IFC middleweight female champion of the world. Unbelievable fight. Big Poppy, tell me you've done that before, man. Yeah, a couple times. Tell you. Times. You've got a future in this business. <laughs> <laughs> great, great fight. The two ladies, you, you see why the, the fellas enjoy watching the ladies go at it. They just get after it, give it their all. Great account of both women tonight. Beautiful, beautiful. Look at Ladies this. and gentlemen, at 2.48 in the first round, the winner by submission from Denver, Colorado, Amanda Buckner. Jennifer, we're going to show some highlights right here. I want you to kind of take us through the end of this fight. Great, great fight. Just kind of take us through it if our monitors come back on here. All right, our monitors actually went out here for a second. The one thing I would like to say about Amanda is the one downfall she did have when we fought was that she was too aggressive and she didn't keep her distance. Uh-huh, uh-huh. And you mentioned that. Perfect. The new champ.